there, my name's Leif Vier, and welcome to your job as a resource extraction specialist. Now, first things first, as for your mm, agreement, anything you do, hear, see, etc., is strictly privileged. You're never to share any of your experience here with anyone, in any instance, for any reason. Whether that be your closest buddy, your sister's boyfriend, or in a court of law. In short, just don't go spouting off about this job. Let's get started. Usually we'd have five other guys working with you to speed things up. But for training purposes, it's just you. <clears throat> Here's the job. You need to collect toy parts to make a giant toy. Get that giant toy on the train, then leave. There's a big pillar in front of you with three puzzles on it. When you solve all of the puzzles, the pillar will dispense one of the toy parts needed. Go ahead and get started. And this one, the buttons are going to light up randomly. If a button lights up, hit it immediately. codes. solving puzzles to get six parts in total, but we went ahead and got the rest for you. You should have enough parts to make a full toy now. So, hold on. Something's not right. See that door with the big orange handle? You should shut that. Quick! for long either. Move it. Crackle across this bit here. All right. Here's the machine. This is where all the toy parts you've collected have been going. Now you've got enough for the whole toy. Grab the handles on that pipe there and begin pulling. See, our engineers set up this cool piping system that'll suction the toy straight from this machine right onto the train. You'll have to do this every time you finish making a toy. that locker behind you? Get inside. Might want to hold your breath so he doesn't hear you. Coast is clear. Get out of the box. Oh yeah. Sorry about that. 
One thing I neglected to mention. The reason we need people like you to get these parts is because these extraction sites aren't exactly... secure. Sharon, I need you to start looking for a new resource extraction guy. Johnny? Maggie? Those two are still alive. Well, great. Lucky for you, buddy. With their help, the three of you can survive down there just fine. Probably. I'll send Bill to get you all out.